Oh, God. DJ Dells, you know I love you. What's really good? It's your boy DJ Dells. A couple of weeks ago, I got a DM from Packy Chips, and they were like, Give me your address. We got a little present for you. Now, I was expecting some new chips because I looked on their timeline. They got tons of new ones that are coming out. But no, it was actually the one chip challenge. They brought it back. <laughs> and this was definitely a surprise. I opened up the package, and as soon as I opened it up, I smelt that, man. That distinct smell from the last time I did it. The last time I did it, they actually sent me a golden bag which was filled with these chips. We've got a sealed gold bag here. <laughs> and uh, me and two of my friends, shout out to Chris, we ate a whole bunch of them out of this golden bag. I have it on video, definitely check it out on the channel. I'll put a pop-up somewhere on the screen when I get a chance. But um, let me make sure this is filming. There we go. <laughs> I don't want to eat this and then it's not filming. So um. What we're gonna do first is take a look at the packaging. If you don't care about that, I'll put like a timestamp in the description box where you could actually get right to the nitty gritty. But I know some of you guys like the packaging, some of the ladies out there. And I have the old packaging also, so we'll do like a quick comparison. So let's do this. All right, so let's take a look at the actual packaging first. Up top it says inside one deadly black tortilla chip. You got your branding here. One chip challenge. Fear the Carolina Reaper. And we'll have some fun and I'll show you the OG packaging right there so you can see a side by side of both packages. On the new box it says warning eat at your own risk not for the faint of hearts. Not everyone will enjoy this extreme heat. And then it just says a bunch of stuff like don't eat it if you're a kid and da-da-da if you're allergic to peppers, if you're pregnant. And then right here it says, after this, hell should be easy. Let's now open the coffin. In the coffin you have great artwork. Can you handle this deadly heat? And then you got the skull with the Carolina Reaper pepper. It also gives you a warning of what to expect. Mouth on fire, short-term loss of speech, <laughs> impaired vision from tears, extreme profanity, RIP. We got to try this. Enough with the packaging. I just wanted to show you it real quick. Now we got to get right into it. There is the chip. We will open it real quick. And we'll put it back in its coffin. That's what the chip looks like. It's black this time. It was not black the first time they did this. Pure madness. Look at this. Here's the chips up close. Got this powder. Wow, look at all that. So this time it is black. Just makes it even more grim. It looks like it's like decayed and um, I definitely um, am in for something. I know that for sure. So without further ado, oh my goodness, it's filled with like it's filled with flavor, like I can feel it. It's all over my finger right there. Let's see, let's do it. I'm gonna have to throw these two halves real quickly. Mm. <clears throat> okay, swallow Delsey. Oh God. Mm. So I'll tell you right now. <laughs> the texture of it is different. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> wow, I feel hot. Give me one second. Mm. Hurts when I talk, but you guys want to hear me talk. Wow. Oh, that's powerful.
Okay, that didn't help. Oh, that made it worse. Wow. There's a lot more seasoning on the actual chip versus the other one. That's for sure. Definitely hotter. Oh, man. It's definitely hotter. Let me know in the comments if you tried it. Hit the thumbs up button too. Uh, shout out to my dude Ryback. He he did the challenge uh, a few weeks ago. He's about to try the new one soon. Ryback TV. One chip challenge. <clears throat> it's hot, man. That Carolina Reaper is deadly. I'm sweating. <sighs> Nose is about to start running. I feel it. <sighs> woo, 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 woo. My Ric Flair shit. Fuck, it's hot. That shit is hot. <laughs> but you're able to control it after a while. It's not really going down. It's just a, a matter of you just adjusting to it. Once you adjust to it, it's good money. I don't recommend you drinking anything. No water, nothing. I forgot that. Last time I did a drink water and it definitely didn't help. Some people do ice cream, all types of shit like that. Just eat it. But it's super hot, man. Like you feel it all in your, your mouth. And in your throat. Pause. <laughs> this released actually today, by the way. Sold out. The pre-order sold out. But... They'll be releasing more live, I think, Friday. I'm going to put the information in the description box below. And follow my social media. Because I'll be tweeting when, you know, it goes live. I'll try my best to flash it real quick. Let me know in the comments what um, box you like better, too, by the way. Which box design do you like better? Get a little interactive with you all. Love these hot challenges. It's been a minute since I've done one. And I think, excuse me, I think that was the first one I've ever done by myself. I like to do them with my friends, you know. It's fun to watch everyone suffer. <laughs> but um, now my friends can watch me suffer on YouTube. Oh, man. And uh, all the chips are really delicious, by the way, guys. There's some of them. I got this ghost pepper chip. It's so good. You can buy them by the bag. I'll put that in the, I'll put that in the description box. I can't even speak right now. I'm like mumbling. But yeah, I'll put that in the description box. I have good chips. They sell them actually at Walmart. I've bought a few bags at Walmart before. So, you know, good chips. Not just all about the hot gimmick, you know, try this one hot chip challenge thing. Like their chips are really good. But um, comparing the old one to the new one, now I can talk a lot better. The, um, the old one, I remember when you put it in your mouth, the seasoning was like very powdery where like when you put it in your mouth, when you breathe in, it would actually just like go all over the back of your mouth. And um, I did that challenge twice. And it was the same time, and it was the same thing every single time. Um, it was hot, man. I can't really tell which one was hotter. They both were pretty freaking hot. I really got to get my guy Chris to try this. 
who's on the channel frequently when we do the food challenges. So I'm hoping I can get um another one of these from my guy Chris. I'm probably going to... Oh, man. <clears throat> Got some, like, acid reflex shit. <laughs> I'm going to have to take some Tums definitely after this. But, um, yeah, I got to have him try this one right here. Uh, when we did it the first time, he ate, um, I think he ate three or four. I ate, like, two and a half because it was in a golden bag, as I was saying. And, um, when I seen this challenge all over the Internet... I reached out to them because they were all sold out. And I was like, yeah, I got to do this challenge. Here's my YouTube channel. And they're like, listen, we don't have any more. But we got a ton. But they're just not perfect. You know, they're kind of broken. So what I could do is send you this package sealed. So they sent me so many of them. I was literally like carrying that with me, keeping it in my car. Whenever I'd run into friends, I'd be like, here, try this. <laughs> but a lot of times people would chicken out. Like, hell no, I ain't doing that. Like, I can't even handle some mild buffalo wings, you know? And um, a few guys were like, I'll try it. I'll definitely try it. And um, I got two videos up. So I'll try to put, like, a playlist up top where you can watch these videos. It's a lot of fun, you know? All of these food reviews, food videos. I enjoy it. I enjoy the hot food. Some people wonder why. It's kind of like a challenge, like a mental and physical challenge, just dealing with the actual heat, you know, the pain. Some people don't get it, though. They're like, that's just sick. Like, why would you want to put yourself through it? But um, it's like a mental challenge, as I was saying. I actually enjoy it. Uh, once you get through it, you know, it's like, man, I toughened that shit out, you know? Like, right now, I feel good, you know? I mean, my mouth is still on fire, don't get me wrong, um, but... It's that initial just smack, that just right in the face, man. I mean, it just, it hits you hard, you know. But then um, you recover, you know. You man up and you recover. And uh, right now I'm like, yeah, I did it. I did the one trip challenge. It's over, baby. And, and, uh, but um, it's definitely still hot. The, the heat isn't over. But I've adjusted to the actual, the fire, the pain, um, Eyes are watering, definitely. I'm sure you could tell on camera. Um, maybe you couldn't. You know, it's hard for me to tell. Um, the screen I'm looking at, the monitor is very small, so it's kind of hard to see how I'm actually looking. I don't even know if my face really got super red, but um, it's very difficult to talk. For me, it was. That was the whole thing. It's like super difficult for me to talk while, you know, eating it. And that was exactly how it was the last time. And I think I handled it a little bit better. Uh, we'll see on the playback, though. I may have looked like a biatch. <laughs> Who the hell knows? Did I handle it like a biatch or did I man up? Let me know in the comments. It's okay if you say I handled it like a biatch. Let me know in the comments, though. But uh, I had a lot of fun with this. I really appreciate them for sending this my way because, you know, like they didn't have to do that. And it just shows that they pay attention to the people that rock with them, that support what they do. So thank you so much for thinking about me and sending me that DM a couple of weeks ago because I was surprised, you know? It's always nice when you get that, like, DM from a company and they're like, hey, we got this new product, we got this, we got that for you to try. It's always a pleasure and an honor and a privilege um, to um, have someone from a company think of you and reach out to you. So I definitely appreciate it. Uh, let me know if you tried it and... Um, Share this video on Facebook, Twitter, subscribe if you're new, and um, let me know if there's anything you want me to try as far as like food challenges. Maybe we'll get this up and running again. Um, I haven't done it in um, about, I would say three months, two or three months. That was like the last time I did a food challenge. I'll put a playlist as I was saying. It'll be like them block pop-ups, them thumbnails toward the end of the screen. Um, so um, definitely watch all the videos. Thanks again for tuning in. Much love out there. And we out.